Dear students, I hope everyone is fine and safe in your homes. So, uh, class three. Before starting the lecture, I want to uh, say something to you, to you all. In this class, as I hope everyone received the message that uh, if you are uh, those students who are having any confusion related to this chapter. he or she can continue and will freely ask me the questions about these chapters so if you are having any kind of problem you can ask me in this lecture there is few, uh, there is a little network issue soon uh, my slide will be able to to you all so student for uh, before uh, when the uh, till then when the slide is not showing into your screen so please everyone open your books chapter number 1 and take the pencil in your own hands and open page 1 of your books so everyone open i hope everyone open your books get ready yourself and and take pencil in your hands and there is a little signal issue i share the screen but it disable i will reconnect again and again hope soon you will be able to see the screen so now my screen is visible to you all so dear student again i am saying that in this lecture we are going to review our lecture so uh, before starting this i am having a short video related to uh, your chapter so every one of you can listen it very carefully in this video you can uh, the related to your chapter number 1 food and feeding habits in this video you can easily see what is going on into your chapter so i am going to play the video if any of you is having a voice issue he or she can tell me in the chat so voice is not coming to you so we need food to remain so again i am going to start this chapter and i am going to tell you side by side that food and feeding habit feeding habits of animals this is a chapter so what are the sources food for animals all living things need food to grow and live energy. food gives us energy we need to food to remain healthy there are two types of so there are two types of animals that is herbivorous animals and carnivorous animals
okay herbivores animals are those which uh, depend upon plant <sighs> these are the examples of herbivores animals so now herba means plants and vores means eater so plant eater animals are not called as herbivores these are the flesh eating animals are called carnivores they depend upon the other animals the example of these animals are visible into your screens so can flesh flesh means meat meat eater animals are known as carnivores so here is a definition they eat both plants and animals animals meat they eat so their examples are these are the examples of omnivores different as different animals see different types of food so their uh, manners of eating is also different their shape of mouth is also different so there is an example of those animals who swallow food here is snake in the picture of snake you can see uh, very clearly and how birds also swallow their food because they don't have the teeth lizards and snake also have small teeth but they are not help in chewing the food they also grab the food and then they swallow it in the previous picture you have seen clearly how snake separate out their jaws and open his mouth wide enough itna bada muh kaise khola tha wo piche previous picture mein visible tha frog or lizard can have sticky tongues birds also swallow the food they are having sharp set of teeth that's why lion and tigers chew the food tear and grind the food similarly crocodile and alligator these both are the examples of those animals who chewing the food and these all animals like tiger crocodile alligator they have very sharp and powerful jaws now these are the example of those animals who chew their food so here is an activity called chewing the cud only occurs in cows and buffaloes in your homes when eid ul adha came you have seen the uh, if uh, someone sacrifice cow then he or she will be able how chewing the uh, card activity is be followed so elephants drink water through its trunk the example of the animals who nibble the food next is lapping of liquid example of these cats and dogs
Now the examples of animals who suck their foods are butterflies and mosquitoes. Their feeding tubes are known as proboscis. In this picture, you have seen butterfly sucks the nectar and mosquito sucks the blood. Now, what we can get for the domestic animals will be visible. These animals give us the milk. These animals give us the meat. These animals give us the eggs. They help us in the farming. They are carrying loads. Okay, they picture so domestic animals should be kept in clean places and should be checked by veterinarian. Veterinarian is a veterinary doctor. Veterinary doctor is that doctor which only treats the animals. So, uh, like uh, when we fall sick, so we go to the doctor. So, the animal's doctor is known as a veterinary doctor. So, we uh, animals should be. Go there, and we should take these animals to veterinary doctor. Any um, uh, the veterinary doctor will tell us why uh, this animal is feeling uh, very uh, weak. What happens to him? This doctor will tell us which medicine we are going to give that um, animal so that he can recover very fast. So moving forward to your books. So kindly unmute the uh, students one by one and students now you are going to read. You are going to read these topics one by one and I will recall the student name of the student who is going to continue with the reading. And now everyone else will listen to that student. So kindly unmute their mics. So get ready students, you are going to start reading by yourself. So if you are having confusion, then you can ask me side by side. Your mics are unmuted or not. So first is, uh, yes, Isha, you raise your hand. Isha, Dania, you both raise your hand till then your mic is not muted. You can write a question in your chat. And I am trying that everyone's mic will be muted soon.
Family from teaching. We are having very shortest of time and we have we are starting with Azan. Azan, continue and we are listening to you. Continue with Okay. In the lesson, you will learn about the food and feeding habit of animal. Animal need food. All living things need food to grow and to live. Animals are living things that need energy to move around and work to give, give them all the energy that need the need food to remain healthy. Okay, for the first uh, page, everyone make a uh, take a pencil and make a underline first one all animals need food underline it what why they need food food to grow and live underline it food to grow and live teacher up teacher teacher underline only the first line this is the most important why they need food they need food to live and Bro, underline it. A living thing need food. Yes, only the first line. Then I have done. Done. Then underline the last line that food gave second last line. Food give them all the energy they need. They need food to remain healthy. Last two lines, underline it. These two are very important. Why they need food? In this line, they will explain. Energy they need. Yes. yes. And then after that, second line. So now, page moving forward to the page number two. And Abdullah... And remain healthy. Yes, also on the line it is on. Now, second page number will be read by Dania. So, Dania, kindly unmute your mic, and Azan, you mute your mic, and Dania will read us. Okay, teacher. Firstly, Dania, unmute your mic, and you are going to read it. Dania, are you listening to me? Azan, unmute your mic. Yes, Azan, now you have done. Dania, unmute your mic and continue reading from sources and food for animals.
Dania, you are not unmuted your mic. Okay, moving forward to the next uh, student because Dania is not giving any response. So, Shajiha, unmute your mic. And you are going to start reading from the source sources of food for animals. Shajiha. Assalamualaikum. Walikum Aslam, Shajiha. Continue reading so everyone uh, will listen. Anima animals obtain food from their surroundings. Different animals eat different kinds of food. They Eat, 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 either eat, eat plants or plant eating animals. Some animals like goat and deer eat plant, plant food like grass and leaves directly. Some other animals like tiger and lion eat the flesh of these plant eating animals. This shows the, that even flesh-eating animals depend indirectly on plants for their food. Yes. The line which was written below the picture, read it. Animals depend on plants for food. And every one of you is going to underline this line that animals depend on plants for food. Now, both directly be depend kar sakte hain or indirectly be kar sakte hain. Teacher? Yes? Teacher, aap kaam par wadiyo? Page number two pe azan, sources of food, jahan pe grass hai, grass was eaten by goat and goat, goat was eaten by tiger. Yeah, teacher, bani? Yeah, teacher, Page number two, Azan. Page number two, sources of food. Page number two, sources of food. 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 Sources Okay. Underline no, this line. Some yes. animals. Some animal teachers. No. Animals depend on plants for food. This line. Achha, teacher. Thank you. The grass. So next student who is continue the reading is Mahat. Mahat, unmute your mic. And Shijiha, you mute your mic. And Azan, you too. Yes, Mahat. Start reading. What animals eat? Based on what they eat, different animals are placed in different grounds. Probably some animals like cow, buffalo, goat, deer, horse, and elephant eat grass, leaves, fruit, nut, or goats. These plants eating animals are called herbivores. Plants. Herb herb is equal to plants and voice is equal to eaters. So underline, every one of you underline this last line. This is the definition of herbivores. The plant eating animals are called herbivores. Underline it, everyone. Yes, now continue Mahal from the next page, page number three. Mahal, unmute your mic and continue reading. Yes, good Mahal. Zebra, reading. Goat, cow. Hmm. Page number three. Some mm -hmm. animals like dogs, cats, and tigers. Don't eat so fast. Snakes 
and short eat the flesh of other animals these are these flesh eating animals are called carnivores carni okay flesh and can be and wars means eater so underline these lines the flesh eating animals are called carnivores this is a definition done now continue mahat ma had continued reading omnivore some animal like deer cow and human beings human beings eat both plants and the flesh of animal they are called omnivores omni all birds eat yes bear, examples bear so human being human Okay, students. As we as uh, now this time is for your question answer. So we will stop uh, reading there, and then uh, in next lecture we will continue from there. How animals feed. So um, moving forward, everyone, uh, your page number one. Every one of you have done the warm up. Sab ne warm up kar liya hai. Yes. Those everyone, yeah. everyone can raise your hands. Teacher, I have not done. इतना इजी है इसमें क्या करना है आपने देट द मंकी इज हंगरी अब ये मंकी जो है वो बहुत भूख है हेल्प हिम टू फाइंड इसका ना मंकी को हमने बनाना तक पहुंचाना हाँ जी बिल्कुल बनाना तक पहुंचाना उसको बहुत भूख लगी है तो वो कैसे फूड लेगा तो इसे जस्ट ये किया हुआ वो जल्दी से ये कर ले फटाफट ये बहुत ईजी पदल है फ्रॉम द नेक्स्ट लेक्चर वी विल कंटिन्यू फ्रॉम देयर एंड फ्रॉम टिल देन फ्रॉम पेज नंबर वन टिल थ्री इफ यू आर हैविंग एनी कंफ्यूजन टिल देन इफ ही और शी एनी बॉय और गर्ल कैन फ्रीली आस्क मी एंड when i will start the saturday lecture i will ask question from these lecture then i first i will ask a question sabse pehle maine questions puchne hai isi topic se related uske baad maine aage continue karna hai because i want my all student will know about these uh, these three topics which we have done today in our class jiski reading ki hai iski explanation bhi maine sabse puchna hai ji azan teacher hamare तो फिर आता तो कर लेना वो जो वहां पे ना जा जा ही नहीं पाता क्योंकि वहां पे ना लाइन लग जाती है आगे जहां से निकलता हूं मैं तो इसको तवज्जो से देखे ना और जहां से रास्ता बंद है उसको चेंज कर लें कोई मसला नहीं होगा आपके लिए ऐसे चलें नेक्स्ट ओके अजान नेक्स्ट सानिया यस यस सानिया फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल दानिया फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई वांट टू से I we call your name and you were not there at that time. Teacher, वो थोड़ी सी मेरे भाई बहन तंग कर रहे थे तो मुझे समझ नहीं आ रही थी मुझे क्या समझ नहीं आ रही आप? Teacher, मेरे भाई बहन कमरे में तो बहुत शोर कर रहे थे मैं उनको आपको क्या समझ नहीं आई? आराम से कह रही थी कि चुप हो जाएं तो मुझे 